Hello ladies, tonight I'm going to show you which skincare line I use. I have been getting quite a few questions about my skincare routine and what it is I do at night before I go to bed. So I'm going to show you step by step on what I use and how long it normally takes me to do it. The first step is to use our makeup remover. It looks like it's oil and water, but it's actually a cleanser and moisturizer all in one. To activate the cleanser, we have to shake it. I usually use the cotton pad to take my eye makeup off. So I'm going to show you how well it works. This eye makeup remover takes um, takes off waterproof mascara, gel eyeliner, liquid eyeliner, lipstick that I'm wearing right now. And this beauty here outsells every other eye makeup in the market 8 to 1. So watch how it works. Okay. See, all of my eye makeup, it's totally off. And I just use one pad. I'm just going to flip it over and use the other side. As you can see, I am not pulling too hard on my eyes. You have to be really gentle with how you take your eye makeup off because the eye area is the most sensitive area in your face. It's the one that tends to wrinkle faster than anything else in your body. Um, so you have to be very, very gentle with it. That's why I love using this eye makeup remover because it's not harsh and it's really moisturizing. And it's also safe for to use if you wear contacts and everything. You might get a little film, but it will dissipate as you um, take it off or wash your face. Okay, so this is the cleanser that I use. It is a Time Waste Repair Volume Foam Cleanser, sorry. And this is for the advanced signs of aging. I don't have advanced signs of, signs of aging, but I still use it. Sorry, I have to come out of the frame so I can wash my face. With this cleanser, you just want to use a small amount because it foams. Just make sure you don't use it on your eye area. Um, uh, it's really gentle, so I don't mind using it on my eye area, but I just don't recommend everybody else doing it. Okay. Look at all that stuff. That's all my makeup. When you dry your face, you want to make sure you're patting your face dry and not tugging or pulling at it because it creates more wrinkles when you pull and tug at your face. Okay, the next step that we're going to do is the Valley From Lifting Serum. I dried up all my face, which I shouldn't have done because I like to put my lip firming serum with my fingers a little bit damp or my face a little bit damp so it glides on easier this one all you need is one pump and remember everything you do to fit to your face you want to do it to your neck too because we don't want to have that turkey neck okay the next step is our volifilm night treatment with retinol this, I do not recommend anyone using this during the day. I have had people tell me, oh, I love how it makes my skin feel, so I'm going to use it during the day. It's not good because it makes your skin, the retinol in it will make your skin more sensitive to the sun rays, and it would irritate your face. So how this bottle works, you just pump it down, and it'll come out. Okay, so then you just grab it. And again, you do little circles on your face. So you can work the product in. And the circles are up and out, just to make sure you're pulling your skin up and not pulling it down. Okay, now the last step is going to be our Voluferm Eye Cream. I love this thing, it comes 
with this little metal tip that is, um, it's the same metal that they use um, with the boxers and the boxing ring. When they get all beat up and swollen, this metal will help um, diminish any puffiness that you might have. This eye cream does everything that our other eye creams do in just one. This eye cream will get rid of fine lines and vertical's dark circles. It will lift your eyelid and it will moisturize your eye area. So we're just going to squeeze a little bit out. And then I'm going to put it in there. And with it, you're just going to put it in. I like to put it all the way up uh, until right under my eyebrow bone. If I were to do this on just half of my face, you guys would be able to see the big difference that it makes. But this was kind of like a last minute video thing that I thought about before I washed my face. That's why I'm kind of like in my pajamas, so. And that is my everyday routine. I hope you guys enjoy this video. If you have any questions, please feel free to comment below. And I will have to make a video for my routine during the day before I do my makeup. I love taking great care of my skin. It doesn't matter what kind of makeup you use. It doesn't matter how expensive it is or how good everybody says it is. If you don't have a good foundation, meaning your skin is not well taken care of, doesn't matter how much you spend on your makeup, it will not look good. So I say invest a little bit more on your skincare so that your makeup can look as good as you know you want it to look. So you guys have a great night and until next time.